How's it guys? Uh, Jay McGeezy here. As requested, I'm going to be doing a review on my Quad 3.0 Scratch Build. My baby. You'll notice it folds up really small. Um, that's one of the main features of it. The other key feature is the two layer system, similar to the QAV500. But it folds out really easily, um, absorbs impact really well if you crash, which I tend to do. Um, you'll notice it's got the double layer system, so it's got the, dry, the clean section, dirty section at the bottom. Um, on my original design, I had to add in some bars over here so that I didn't get any yawing uh, or any twisting during the yaw motion. Running, you can run a GoPro, I'm running a SubTech, it's cheaper. On the front, uh, my video TX is antenna plugged in right here. It's as far away. The other the receiver's antenna as I can pretty much put them. I could go a little more extreme, but there's no need for it. Uh, so that mounts there. I've got my receiver down this end by the battery. Um, and then I've got a couple things to power my FPV system, all that you can find on the internet. I'm running the Turnigy 25C 2.2 amp hour batteries. Uh, they get a little warm while flying. I'm tempted to go to the 30C, but I'll make the decision when I order my next set of batteries. I'm running these guys here. It's a DST1200 from Hobby King. It's one of the cheapest motors on their site. Um, and I'm running 9x4.7 props. It can run a 9x6, but I can't get 9x6 counter rotating. And then over here, these are reflashed super simples uh, from Hobby King. The 15 18 amps reflashed with Simon K. It worked great. Um, my, plugs, my power plug straight onto my bottom board, which works as a distributor board. It's just a bit bent for the crash I had. Um, yeah, the power up. My KK board has no LCD. Luckily I had done some configuration before I had my accident and broke the LCD. Uh, I've got it tuned now with no LCD. I've got it tuned very well. What notice is the strobe lights on the bottom. Uh, we'll be posting a build on that. I need to build another one. I want to put two, one strobing on one second and one strobing on two or three seconds just for better visibility. It's just a five timer. Like I said, there will be a tutorial on that. Anyway, guys, now I'm going to do some flying so you can see the flight characteristics. Thank you.